Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is your favorite Chikmun sisters already and this is another edition of my travel. However, this video is about my layover in Paris, France, okay? So I have a 23 hours layover here in France today and the options are very limited but before I proceed to the layover and some of the things that you may or may not be able to do, I will give you brief information on how this all started. So this trip that I'm taking today was very spontaneous in a sense of there are urgent matters that needed to be taken care of, therefore it was not planned. So I decided to book a flight, get on my way here, and I'm heading to my destination, which a lot more videos are to come. And so I decided to book a flight. Yeah, I am 23 hours layover. So, after I realized it was a 23 hour layover, I literally called my friends. I have friends in, in all of you, most of Europe, okay, not all of Europe. Let's just erase that part. I have some friends in Germany. It, it would take like six to seven hours train to get here to Pai. And then I have some friends in Portugal and I have some friends in France so I told them like hey I'm coming over there I'm gonna have 23 hours layover let us meet up and catch up mm. so many of the, the friends that I have in France I was like all right all right but wait a minute mm, I don't think we can see you then my friends in Germany was like oh actually Emma yeah I can book the train I can come over there and I said Roger 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 no 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 we can meet sad face okay so then i had to realize well i can't meet with my friends what else can i do i have to problem solve right now because these 23 hours are not gonna go by fast but the problem with this is that even with the 23 hours i just can't exit the airport because currently with the coronavirus going on, U.S. citizens cannot transit outside of the airport. They have to stay within the airport. You can't enter the country. You can just transit. So what does that mean for your travel? That means you have very limited things to do. So if you were exiting or transiting in France, Pahi, what should you know? Understand that you can't leave the airport. You just can't. Even hotel that is within 300 meters, you cannot go there. You have to stay at the one and only hotel in Charles de Gaulle Airport in Paris. So let me show you the hotel. And then we'll go on to tell you the price of the hotel, some of the limitations of the hotel, and what are some benefits of this hotel. So let's go. Let me take a look at the hotel. Let me show you. So you're gonna see it's right here. This is the hotel. This is the hotel. This is the entry of the hotel. And that is it. So, I decided to make a reservation today. So the good thing about this is that it is directly across from Terminal 2. So you can book your reservation, you can take a nap, you can sleep, you can sit there. Unfortunately, this place do not have restaurant. So you're only gonna be using Wi-Fi and you're only gonna be taking a nap if you decide to pay for the whole day or not. So the thing about this hotel is that you can do two hours, you can do four hours, you can pay for six hours, you can pay for eight hours. A whole day is considered 12 hours. So for example, me, I got here around two o'clock. There is no space available until 6 p.m. So I had to pay $208. Well, initially it was 226 euro and I was like, oh, okay. That's not too bad, even though it's bad. That's not too bad. Well, 226 equals 280 euro. I don't know. I don't know the math. But do you know what it gets you? A little, little queen-sized bed that I have yet to see. 
But you know why? The 23 hours, I just have to sleep. I have to get rested and I just have to chill. That's why I got that place. I did say they don't have a restaurant. So if you want to go to a restaurant, please say this. Ooh, Ella, a restaurant. S'il vous plaît. That's how you ask them for where the restaurant is. Unfortunately, you have to take another train. Train K takes you to a restaurant outside of the airport. So no, you're out of luck. Please do not try it. Or else you're gonna get stuck and they will send you back to your destination. Okay, we don't want that. So what I did was, I saw a good old security guide and I said, Monsieur, ça va, ça va bien et toi? You know, just introduce myself. Je m'appelle Emma, et toi, and blah, blah, blah. And we chatted a little bit and I told him, what? I asked him, where's the restaurant? And he said, uh-oh, there is no restaurant here. Unless you transit or actually you get out of the airport, then you can get the restaurant. So I said, monsieur, 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 no, 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 no. I'm hungry. So this good old man went over there. He used his pass. He got me some food, which of course I got some baguette. I got some sandwich. Good stuff for how much? <laughs> $35. So not only that this place do not have hotels that you can go to during COVID time, they don't have restaurant within the hotel. You can only go outside of the, the airport for restaurants. They are also very expensive. So all in all, please, please plan accordingly. What would I do differently if I was rebooking this flight? One, I will probably not do a long layover. Two, I will book the hotel, which is the hotel I just showed you is the only hotel that's in the airport that you don't have to leave the uh, airport to go to other location because if you do that, they will send you back to your country. That's the only hotel. And that's my feedback for anyone looking to have a layover right now in France at this specific location. Please do not book anything longer than two hours as far as layover. I didn't see uh, shops. Again, because you have to take the train somewhere else to the next terminal and you're getting out. Don't get out, please. So, so far things have been good. I, other than, you know, the hotel issue and not having food, the atmosphere is good. I don't understand why people think French people are mean. French people are not mean to me. I don't think French people are mean. Just make a little effort to speak French. Even if you don't know a full blown sentence or whatever it is, just say bonjour and merci. You know, these little phrases helps. C'est vous plaît, please. C'est bon. All of these little, little things want to see. It's like, oh, oh, oh. And many of you like to say un peu, un peu. Bonjour. As long as they see you making an attempt to try, they are willing and willing and willing to help you. So my takeaway is, please plan properly because right now you're a citizen or not coming into Europe. Unless you're a US citizen, uh, European citizen or a French citizen, you have your passport, please plan accordingly. Thank you for subscribing, sharing, commenting. If you like the video, give more thumbs up. Like I said, more videos are coming up for about this trip. Okay.